of child care workers caught on tape abusing a child with special needs. Video allegedly showing Kaderica Smith taunting and berating an eight-year-old autistic boy. Investigators say Alexis Henderson laughs as she records it all. News Channel 8's Melissa Marino has more. She's at Children's Academy in Winter Haven where this happened. We're told that these two women were trained here to help children with special needs, but police say they were not trained to do this. The video, heartbreaking to watch. An eight-year-old autistic boy taunted, berated, a book bag thrown at his face. At one point, he's tripped and falls to the ground. They weren't trained to treat a child like that. Police say these two certified child care workers, Kaderica Smith and Alexis Henderson, are the ones who did it. One of them even posted the video on Snapchat. And they thought this was OK and they thought it was okay. During their interview, they thought they had done nothing wrong. In the video, you can hear them laughing, but Kaderica Smith wasn't laughing today in front of a judge. But she will not have any contact with the alleged victim in the matter. We learned she has three children in coaches cheerleading in Little League. We also went to Alexis Henderson's Dundee home. A family member we spoke with admits she saw the video. I feel like everything not meant to be on social media, but at the end of the day, everybody made mistakes. Can't nobody judge them with God. Parents we spoke with outraged. As an autism parent, I was angry. I was upset. That's your biggest fear. Ray Ryan's eight-year-old son attended our Children's of Winter Haven until 2015. She claimed she witnessed other staff improperly handling a child and immediately took her son out. Walked in on um, them, kick it, them dragging a child down the hallway by their feet and legs. An attorney with the school tells us they do not tolerate this behavior and they fired the two women immediately. He would not comment about that 2015 incident. In Winter Haven, Melissa Marino, News Channel 8.